Hey, welcome back to Pogoski Pins and Collectibles. And I'm pretty excited today because I want to share with you my D23 box. So as a D23 member, uh, you can get access to special events, um, D23 membership merchandise that you can get on Shop Disney. Uh, there are discounts um, in the parks and at certain stores uh, when you're at the theme parks. Uh, I personally haven't really leveraged the discounts or those kinds of bonuses because being Canadian, it's kind of tough to use those, but I do appreciate the D23 membership merchandise and I have access to that. Uh, for example, I have like Captain America pins that were only available to D23 members. I have I have movie pins that were only for D23 members. So there's been a number of merchandise boxes. And when you renew your membership almost annually, they will always have some sort of box that they provide to their members. And it doesn't matter if you're a new member or a renewing member, you get one of these boxes. So uh, I ordered my D23 membership uh, this past August as part of my birthday celebration. So I got this box uh, in the mail. Now it didn't come like this. It came in another box, so it was protected. But this is what this year's box looks like is this, we're celebrating uh, 50 most magical years at Walt Disney World Resort as part of the D23 um, box. And I, you know, we're all, any of us who watch these things and are into Disney, we're all into the parks, right? For a variety of different reasons. But while Disney World is my home park, because I am not from the West Coast, I'm an East Coaster. So I've been to World a half dozen or more times. And I absolutely, actually probably more, probably more like a dozen times because I lived in Florida for a couple of years. Uh, but I absolutely love Walt Disney World. So I want to open this with you so you can see this with me. I have not opened this box yet. I don't really even know what's in here. I have not watched any spoilers. I didn't even read the website as to what was in this box. I wanted to be fully surprised. So here we are. <laughs> here we go. So again, that's what it looks like. So let's let's open her up. Oh, 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 oh. My official Disney Gold member um, certificate, which is part of the fan club, makes it official. All right. And this fell out. This is the Welcome to the Club Walt Disney World News. And this is really cool. Actually, I got to put my glasses on so I can see what I'm doing here because I can't read without them. All right, let's do this. Oh yes, there we go, now I can see. Um, a whole new year of Disney awaits, and it's a whole story of D23, the expo, the park, and then you can see there's some pictures there. We've got, uh, what is it, Roy with Mickey Mouse, January, and we've got Goofy and Pluto down below. And anyway, there's a number of pictures and interesting tidbits in here, the D23 collection, so that's pretty cool. I really like that. All right, what have we got? You also, when you're a D23 member, you not only get your certificate that validates that you're a D23 member, but you also get a gold member card. Now, this is what you would bring with you to the parks because there's a fan club number on the back of this that you can use to get those discounts I was telling you about or access to things. Um, okay, so then we have 50 years of Walt Disney World, the vacation kingdom of the world then and now. Oh, this is like a record. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Bear Band Serenade from the Country Bear Jamboree and nothing can stop us now. I think this is actually a record. Is that possible? Maybe it's a CD. I'll open it up and see. Oh, this is really cute. Check it out. There's Orange Bird. Isn't he adorable? Love that. All right, let's open this up. I'll go, I'll open that up after. Ooh, uh, we got a lunchbox. Oh my God, this is adorable. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me get this out. All right, this is just too darn cute. Check this out. Oh, 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 like, I'm sorry, I'm not back in the office, but man, would I ever use this for my lunchbox? Like, I know this is a collectible item and people would, would be like, you're crazy, you should put that on a shelf somewhere. I would probably use this as my lunchbox, seriously. There's the other side with some villains on there, it looks like. You got Figment, you got Sunny Eclipse. Oh, this is so, so, so adorable. There's some on the sides. Here's some pictures. There's Remy. And then who's on this side? Oh, we've got some, we've got the birds from the Tiki. This is adorable. Check this out. Contemporary Resort right there and the Nautilus. Wow. Love that. Okay, let's open her up. And oh my goodness. My golly gosh goodness. Check this out. Look at those pins. Those pins are enough to drive me bonkers. I absolutely... That orange bird pin, too much for me to handle. And look at Figment. Oh my gosh. These pins are 
beautiful. And the thing is, is that they are a soft enamel and you can tell because they're sunken in. So um, the better quality pins that Disney have is a hard enamel and the hard enamel pins don't, the, the ink doesn't actually sink into the spaces. It actually sits flat. And it's funny because these pins, although they're very beautiful and super bright, um, they're actually of a lower quality than some of the other pins that are out there. And if you were to see a pin like this that was of a different version or a different set, you might actually think it was fake because it's soft enamel. And like I said, I know it's hard to tell on the camera, but the soft enamel pins are when the um, enamel kind of sinks into the gaps. So you can kind of see it on the D there of, the, of Walt Disney World, the blue D, like a concave sort of section. Anyway, nonetheless, I love these pins. They're adorable, absolutely adorable. And I think that's it. I think there's only the pins in here. Yeah. So that's it for that. Now there is something else in here. Oh, it looks like it's a banner. Check this out. D23, the official Disney fan club. And it's just plain in the back. And I guess you could put it up on a wall or what have you. Love that. All right. So we got that. And I'm just going to open up this CD slash record business here. I want to kind of see what's in here. I'm curious. And I'm opening it up, which is making it completely no longer collectible, but I don't care. I want to see what's in here. And it is a record. Oh my goodness. Golly gush goodness. Let's check this out. I don't have a record player, so I don't know what I would play this on, but it's a record. Check it out. So the B side is nothing can stop us now from Minnie and Mickey's runaway railway railway. I can't say that apparently. And the bear band serenade is on the A side. Um, anyway, so yeah, this is no longer collectible because I took it out of its plastic case. Don't care. It is mine to keep. So there, I don't plan on reselling any of this stuff. Anyway, um, amazing. Like I said, if you are, have always thought about it, it's kind of pricey. Um, I think it's a hundred dollars a year, $120 a year or something like that U S. So it's kind of pricey, but I really just enjoy being a D23 member. I mean, my, my license plate has D23 incorporated into it. So, uh, I'm a huge, huge, huge Disney fan as evidenced by my, my tattoo. Uh, I, I'm like hardcore, hardcore. So I absolutely love these kits. I, they're high quality, the, they come super safe and protected. Uh, I've never been disappointed by the D23 uh, boxes that come every year. If you're questioning whether you want to get it again, it depends. You know, if you, again, it's, it has to do with the collectibles, you get collectible access that maybe you wouldn't get if you didn't have the membership, it might be worth it for you. Now, for some people, it might not be worth it because you can't leverage. I mean, especially if you're Canadian and you're not traveling to the States right now, or you're not a frequent flyer, so to speak, at the park, you might not be able to access some of the perks of being a D23 member in the parks. At one time, D23 members, I believe, had free parking or something. That's not the case anymore. But there are perks to being a D23 member when you go to the parks. And if you're not going to the parks frequently, it might not be worth it for you. But for me, I absolutely love this. So... Anyway, I just wanted to share this box with you because I have been waiting for a couple of weeks now to open it so that I can share it with all of you so that you can see what you get in one of these boxes. And uh, I would love to see your videos. If you want to put a link down below, I'd be happy to take a look at your videos when you reopen your boxes to see your reactions. But, uh, but yeah, leave a comment down below if you've ever gotten a box you really, really happy with or maybe really disappointed with. I'd, I'd love to hear your comments on this. So anyway, thanks for watching Flagowski Pins and Collectibles and we'll see you next time.